educated mother just served us nine pizza pies? Let's see. There are nine, the nine first letters of those nine words. And there are nine planets with Mercury closest to the sun and Pluto furthest away. And in between... My very educated mother just served us nine pizza pies. Mercury is the smallest. Venus is about the same size we are, but the resemblance quits there. Its atmosphere is ten times as dense as ours, shrouding the surface completely. And the average temperature is the boiling point of lead. And Earth? Earth? Well, that's us. My very educated M. Mars. How about Mars? Through Earthbound telescopes, we can watch Mars turn greener by seasons. Watch what might be polar ice caps advance and recede. Does that mean Mars has a summer and winter? Earth telescopes develop questions. Photographs from spacecraft like Mariner are beginning to supply answers. But man, do we still have a lot to learn. Hey, NASA! My very educated mother, J. J is for Jupiter the giant, 300 times the size of Earth. Its atmosphere is a lethal smog of ammonia and methane and hydrogen. Likely there are fantastic lightning bolts flashing all through it. But you know, that's almost the same combination our Earth had a few billion years ago. At about the same time, early forms of life appeared. Did you know that Jupiter has a big red spot on it? It's oval-shaped, as wide as Earth, and three times as long. And it shifts position on the planet in a mysterious way. Why? Questions. Questions. My very educated mother just shut the ba ba Saturn has those rings, and we've measured them. They're more than 37,000 miles wide, but only about six miles thick. Hmm. Then comes Uranus and Neptune. Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune are called the four giant planets. But Pluto is puny and cold. So that makes nine planets spinning around our sun, one of a hundred billion suns in our single galaxy. In turn, one of ten billion other galaxies. My very educated mother just served us nine pizza pies.